Reaver, get the hell out of here! Go on, go! I've got some people coming out of the North Gate! Go! What's the win, son of a bitch? You know that? Killing all those rippers. <laughs> oh, yeah. Drown them like they were a bunch of fucking rats! You can make the work of a solid. I'll bet you that Iron Mike didn't see it that way. Here, catch! Get the hell out of here! Go on, go! I've got some people coming out of the North Gate! Go! Something scares me. There was a time when I would have uh, dragged you out into the shit, and I would have left you to the freaks. Hey, 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 hey. I'm not gonna do that. You wanna know why? Because they would tear you limb from limb. But you know what? They wouldn't enjoy it. Shut up! All 
Daniel, I know what's happening out there. Out there, outside the Ark. But it's out there. We are safe in here. Nothing can touch us. Do you hear me? God has ordained this place. This is consecrated ground. We are safe in this place. We are safe in this place. I don't know when or why, but I, uh, I, I saw something. A, a month ago, maybe, I... I felt something. Something I... I hadn't felt in a long time, and, um... And I know that a lot of you might have... Might have felt the same way, and I... I think that if we just... Can... Deacon? I'll have your side on. Let him go, Colonel. It's all over. Your militia is done. Would you like some tea? I'm sure you would. Sarah, would you pour the drifter a cup of tea? The Ark was our only hope. You realize that, of course. When the world was cleansed, it was the only thing that would allow us to rebuild. Everything was here, protected, saved by the grace of God. <laughs> we never did find someone to play the piano, though, did we? <laughs> ah, it doesn't matter now. When all this is gone, there'll be nobody left to hear the music. You've destroyed us. You destroyed everything we worked for. No, Colonel, you did when you started this holy war. You know, given the choice between you and the freaks, I'm gonna have to go with them, because at least when they kill, they're just looking for a meal, and they don't kill unarmed women. No! <laughs> Set up a triage tent over there. Hey. Hey, there's a cave entrance over there. You'll find supplies and bad. Just get some men. Go. You, you, let's go. Ricky! Patty. Does anyone hear me? I can help. I'm a doctor. <laughs> it's over. Everyone that wasn't. Killed or wounded by the blast, pretty much just gave up. Where's Boozer? Ricky, I need some help over here. The north gate, the south gate, boo! Ricky! Yeah. Hope you save some for me. Boozer. Yeah. Sorry, I'm late. No. Yeah. 
<laughs> no, no, no. I jumped. <laughs> no, what the fuck? Just you were... before I ran out of bridge. I saw yeah. the truck. No, no, no. I felt the blast wave. Even under 10 feet of water. Now, that was a ride. <laughs> What? You didn't think I'd blow myself up, did you? Then who'd be around to bust your balls? I would. <laughs> hey! Oh! Hey. Little sister. Oh. Yeah, yeah, long story. So, um, I hear someone's been looking for you. <laughs> what? Kind of wouldn't shut up about it. Yeah, don't listen to him. It was really more his idea <laughs> than... Ricky! Eddie! Which one of you is driving me out of this shithole? It's all yours, brother. So I hear that you're staying on to rebuild. Not all the Colonel's ideas were bad. Just the batch of crazy ones. You're the second person to tell me that. Who else? Corey? You know what? Fuck that dude. Hey. He left us here to rot. If it wasn't for him, we'd all be dead. Whatever, man. Then I think we'll try this again without all the army man bullshit. <laughs> hey. You didn't miss my speech. No, I wouldn't say I'm gonna miss it. Deke, hell of a fight. Yeah, that was. Manny, oh shit, look who's still breathing. Nose down. Nose down. Keep it on your face that way. <laughs> Not bad for a drifter. Brother, we did it. You did it. Ah, uh, man, you know, I gotta uh, admit for a second there, I thought that you were um, gonna blow myself up. I told you I got shit to do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. uh, Give him hell, brother. Yeah, here it goes. Chuck would be proud. did it. We did it. Come here. <laughs> See? Good things happen when you stop and light a candle. Well, this is sort of more bonfire, but... Right. Yeah. <laughs> Never seen you give a speech before. Oh, come on. It ain't gonna be a speech. Okay. Man. <laughs> Shit. That's enough of that. Uh, what does it mean that they're all getting quiet? Oh, yeah, they're waiting for you. God, it's your cue. <sighs> <clears throat> I know we got a lot of rebuilding to do, so I'm gonna keep this short. Look, I'm not a leader. Yeah, right. no, I don't care what you say, I'm not. But, um, you've done something here today. We've done something. We banded together to fight. Uh, not because some asshole told us to, but because it was the right thing to do. And you know what? We won. Yeah, I've seen you struggle to rebuild. I've seen you fight to save lives, to keep people safe, keep people fed. I've seen you sacrifice everything that you have, everything that you are. Make the world a better place. And see, that's why we're still here. That's why we're still here. Because if we don't have hope for a better life, 
or for a future that matters? Yeah. Now we fight for it. Yeah. You know, Iron Mike, he, uh, yeah, Iron, Iron, he once said to me that, that we make the world what it is by what we do. Huh? What did we do? Huh? What are we going to do? See this? This is the first step. I thought you weren't going to give a speech. Yeah, I screwed up. Uh, how was it? You know, it was, it was all right for an outlaw biker. Outlaw biker, huh? <laughs> are you ready to ride? Old lady? I don't know. It depends. Where are we going? Wherever the hell we want. Cause the price 